Hi, this is Ron Watts, and I have a Tyrode tripod here in this nice little bag. And I want to show you something in this bag. See, it's nice carrying. You can wear it over your shoulder and carry it around with you. And the cool thing about this bag is there is this little push button deal on the end of it. Looky there. That's on the end, and then that just opens up, and voila, you get that out. But it's all nicely contained, part of that. Now, that's cool. Nice design. I like that. So let's get this tripod out here and take a look at it. Look at this beauty. Now, you know on these things normally you got feet, okay? So there's the feet, and this is a leveling foot, see? It'll adjust to whatever kind of position you need right there. See? That's pretty cool. And then you can extend it. Of course, we do that extension. And then we can do this extension. And then we can do this extension. Wow, that's a lot of extensions, isn't it? Look at that thing. Now you can use that as a monopod like that, right? Okay, let's go ahead and figure the rest of this. Now up here, we have a little lever that pops this guy free. And uh, when you get this guy free on spring, you gotta hold it. That's nice, it's spring-loaded so it doesn't just fall out on you. And there's your attachment that you attach to the camera, right? So you put that back in there, let go of the lever. See, and that's going to stay there regardless, and then you snap it to hold it closed. And, of course, you have an arm that you can adjust. Let me get this guy out of the way here. Got an arm you can adjust, so you got that adjustable. You got this adjustment. You loosen this a little bit. It makes this one easier to adjust, okay? And then... You get it in position where you want it, tighten that down, tighten this down. It's not going to go anywhere. It's nice and solid. Gives you a good rigid balance there. Over here, you got your adjustment for opening this guy up. So if you want your camera vertical instead of horizontal, or whatever kind of angle you need it at, you tighten that one in the position you want there. And then, of course, you can make this guy go even higher. Oh, wait a minute, let's get this loose in here so we can turn it around. Right. Tighten that down. Now we've got this little guy here, a crank. So you can crank that up and up and up and up. There. So you got, there's your height, my friends. Look at that. Now that's, I'm a six foot tall guy. And let's see what we can do here. I'm a six foot tall guy. There's the top of that thing. That's pretty amazing. That is cool. Here's something else that's cool. Right here on the top, you got a bubble level. So you can make sure your tripod is absolutely level, if that's what you need to do. And then there's something else here. There's a hook down here. You see that hook? Can I yeah, put my hand in front of it? You can see it clearly, see? See that hook? So you can hang a weight there. So if you're out in a windy area, hang that weight there, this guy is not going anywhere. I mean, he's going to stay in one spot. And that's pretty handy to do if you're on a mountaintop or any of those various places. You're in a high wind area. You've got a hurricane going. You hang a, a good heavy weight right there. Or tie a rope to that. Drive a stake in the ground. Tie it down. It's not going to go, you know. And that's something that's really handy to have. Now, I didn't extend all of these guys. I'll just go ahead and do that. We'll do this one, too. Yeah, get them all. And there you go. That is a pretty... Oh, okay. There you go. <laughs> pretty neat, isn't it? And, of course, when you take this guy off here... Take your camera with you. Take another picture, leaving the tripod alone, and it, this just remains attached. Oh, and you know how you used to have these things? You had to use a coin to tighten them up on your camera? Guess what? You don't have to. Can you see that lever there? Look at that. See? That just folds over. But you take this up. Okay, now you can screw that in. You don't have to have that coin anymore. That's a handy way of doing it. I like that. And, of course, you can change this thing to other positions. I guess you could turn it around the other way. Yeah, maybe not. Nope. Okay. 
So I guess it goes that way. No, I guess you can turn it around. Yeah, you can turn it around. Okay. So you reverse it and do it frontwise. You just have to have a lever out while you're doing it. Duh, silly me. There. That is awesome. I mean, I'm impressed with that. Let's see, that allows me to turn it around easily and slowly, right? And then, of course, this guy here allows me to tilt it however I want to do it. That's cool. I like that. Big thumbs up. This is a healthy looking tripod, well built, and it is going to last a long time. And those feet, I like that. It's a self leveling. You know, you just get it, sit it down on the ground, and it levels itself. They level themselves so they're flat on the ground and they're going to stay there. Big thumbs up.